All right, we are currently at the Bethesda Church, and um, here's the organ, and I thought I'd do a quick demonstration video for the organ. Um, first, we'll just start out with a few neat things about the organ. Um, different features. Over here we have um, a few stops from the organ up on the balcony way in the back, um, which is coupled to the uh, positive. Um, you can barely hear it as it's so far in the back, but it adds a nice echo effect. Um, especially the, the cornopian and the clarion. Usually you have to combine them with the, uh, the oboe because the cornopian has some dead notes. And that's one of the features. Another feature is the 32 foot resultant, which has its own little switch and indicator. Now in order to have this, in order to get this to work, you have to activate the, um, the Quintetin. So I turn that on, and it's of course controlled by the pedals. And then I flick this on. See, it turns red. I don't know if you can hear the rumbling. Another cool feature, controlled by the positive keyboard, is the, um, the chimes, which I've seen kind of back there, that chimey thing, which you see this dial right here, probably can't even see the lighting, but I would switch that on, and I play. So that's pretty cool. Now, voices. We have three keyboards, the swell, the gray, and the positive. The positive is located directly above me. Um, and this section of stops right here is the positive. We have the, the crumb horn, zimbal, so I'll play. Not very good alone. The layer gut. The tears. Principal. Two foot. Alright, that's that. The copo flute, which is four foot. It's a positive down here, which we also have a sub octave. Um, then the great keyboard is this. Uh, this these stops right here. So we have the eight foot trumpet. Uh, mixture. Um, octave. Spitz flute. Four foot. Um, four foot octave. Um, Gordon. Eight foot. Eight-foot principal, and a sixteen-foot quintet. And then my personal favorite keyboard, the Swell, which is right here. We have the tremulant, which I can't activate by itself. We have a clarin. 
um, eight foot trumpet. And a faggot. Sixteen foot. A um, scarf, I think I pronounce it. Do the mixture. Flat foot. A uh, knocked horn. Which, believe it or not, is not a horn, it is a flute pipe. Spitz principle, four foot. Spitz float celeste, which would go with the, uh, the other celestes. Very warm sound on um, the Spitz float. Um, that, but that is a Celeste. Uh, and civilizational. And a Borough Flute. Then we have the Pedal Division. Which, so first we have the Salmon, which is like a trumpet sound. Plumber, eight foot, octave, quintessence, which we use with the, we use with the resultant. You can kind of hear it. Sub bass. You probably can't hear it, but it sounds like the bass of a car. And a principal. That's it for voicing. And there's one very important stop that says full organ. Because if you activate that, you go to their full organ. It's very loud. Very useful stop. I actually used that the first video I recorded the Takata on. That's it.